Fabulous. Thank you for joining me for my October lipstick shop my stash. Yes, as I told you last month, I will be picking certain lipsticks and I will wear them for the entire month. I tried to pick out some fall and berry colors that were in my collection. I do not have many because I feel like darker color lipsticks just require a lot more maintenance as far as uh, wearing. You got to keep it off your lip, off your chin, off the bottom of you, off your nose. You got to keep it off papers. You can't hit your mouth and touch a paper. Dark colored lipsticks require more work, more technique, and more maintenance. But I do own a few. And a lot of you requested it. So yes, these will be my lipsticks of the month. I am so glad that it is October 1st because I was about to flip my lid. Although I do pick a random amount of lipsticks to play around with, I still was, by the end of September, I was ready to change. This will allow you to get more use out of your lipsticks. I use one lipstick at each lipstick at least once a week. Some of them in combination with each other for an entire month. Yes, along with some lip glosses. Let's get started. All right, so my new lippy of the month, I got one from Lynette Longmire and one from Samaya. So I have two of these bad babies from the Ipsy bag, and this is gorgeous alone, just by itself. I didn't even pick a nude lipstick for the month. I always keep a nude in my wallet anyways, but this will be the nude that I will be playing out for the month. Gorgeous, no lie, gorgeous. This came out of the Ipsy bag. That will be my nude. Okay, and the next lip gloss I am going to show you guys, without dropping you guys, is going to be the Alme Lilac Love. Alme Lilac Love, and it's just these creamy lip glosses that came out a while back, and I have a lot of these in different colors. That's going to be a lip gloss for this month. The next lip gloss I picked out for this month is Strawberry Parfait by NYX. And the final, no, that's not the final one. Another lip gloss I picked out for this month is Pink Candy, and it's the Elf Glossy Gloss. And the final lip gloss I picked out for this month I received in a swap, and it is the Bobbi Brown Lip Gloss. It's a rich color lip gloss in Pink Puff, and this has a little bit of a tingle, and I didn't know it. But it's not that bad. It's not as bad as Buxom. Not as, it goes away after a while. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and try to use this up. I received it in a swap. I actually thought this was a concealer when I swapped with the young lady. And then when I got it in the mail, it was a lip gloss. Looks like a little trial size. So, I just figure by the end of October, this should be done. That should be done. Lipsticks. Pink lipstick of the month. You know, I got to have a pink in there. It's Pink Minx. This is by e.l.f. Moisturizing lipstick. Don't sleep on e.l.f. Absolutely awesome. It looks like this. That will be my pink lipstick for the month. It may be featured in with a bunch of other stuff, but that's my pink. And for Barry, this does not have a name. This is 565. This is an NYX round lipstick it's right there and I wonder not bad I mixed it with that pink one from elf look at that oh yeah your girl will be doing some combinations yes she will NYX round lipstick entire month the next two will be by Nika K and one is lavender tint in this type of packaging lavender may not be so much of a fall color but you guys know I don't believe there's any rules to make up and I'm gonna mix that bad boy in with something and I'm gonna wear it and the next one by Nika K is 917 plum brown and I have never even used this this is still brand new Ooh. Yeah, she's got to get mixed. Look at that. I know y'all loving that. It's a red, brown, plummy color, and I know y'all loving it. I know. But she has got to get mixed. Oh, I just mixed her with the lilac. I'm going to mix her with the pink and the other one. Pretty. 
yeah so this is a little bit too dark for me i will play it out and take pictures on instagram for you ladies that love to see me in dark lips i wear it by itself one day um it doesn't look like it needs any gloss it's it's very um creamy very moisturizing but i will wear it one day for you ladies so we have 30 days of lipsticks let's get to mixing mingling getting these combinations together and getting the most out of our makeup all right remember makeup is not one size fits all and i'll see you the next time we plan our makeup